Hi guys, so the reason that I'm making this video is because I decided I'm going to do the Monistat challenge or the Myconazole Nitrate challenge and the reason why my hair is wet because I just got out of the shower I applied the Monistat to my scalp and I decided to do the diluted method where you dilute it with water what I did was I got a strip out of the tube that was about this big, probably about an inch or an inch and a half. And then I put probably about three tablespoons of water in it. You really don't need much because it'll be so liquidy that it'll just like go, it'll really get into your scalp. It'll spread evenly. That's what I mean. It'll spread. And so I think next time I'm going to actually do it once my hair is dried a little bit more. So that way it'll soak into my scalp better. I just decided I wanted to get it done and over with this time. But next time I'm going to wait till my hair dries more. I think it'll be a little bit less messy because it'll absorb in better. Um, as of right now, my hair, my hair is wet right now, as you can see. I don't know why I just said that because it's pretty obvious. It's my collarbone is right here, so it's like just past my collarbone. Um. I also dyed my hair not that long ago. You can't really tell right now because my hair is wet. I don't think you'd even be able to tell when it's dry. But my roots only come out to like about here. Uh, so I'm also going to be basing it, my hair growth. Not just by the length but by how far my roots have come out. Have came out also. This, so this is just my starting video. I said that I was going to make a video before I started, but I just said, hey, I'm going to do it, and I figured I just now did it. My hair's not going to grow in five minutes, so that is all I have to say f right now. If you would like to see some of my other videos, you can go check them out and subscribe if you like. Alright, thanks guys.